Welcome to High Team. We have a lot of money and seafood towers. Okay, we don't have seafood towers right now, but we do have Zach. It's you and me for this one. James is meeting us on the other side. Road trip! Woo! Road trip! Let's see what you can do in High Z on the way to Guanajuato. James says he's setting up, but he's probably just window shopping. I heard that. So you probably know this already, but High Z has some gosh dang history. We did everything to this thing. Wheels, tires, brakes, coilovers, turbo, body kit. Hundred thousand dollars worth. I mean, I did most of the real mechanic stuff, and James said, Mo power a bunch. Oh, oh, oh. The power delivery is so smooth with these turbos. Everything about the car is pretty sweet. The seats could be more comfy. And the best part, on track day, just when we were getting clean laps, and we broke it. Black flag. Womp womp. Just another day in the life of High Z. Thanks for the ride. Now, where's Pumphrey at? Oh, cool! Whose Miata is this? Some Horizon drivers starting their own muddy pit? Man, I love that car. Hey, time's wasting. I'm not paying you to sit around talking about cars. You don't pay me at all! Okay, James. Why are we in the back? Because Donut Media is a business, all right? We do car culture, positive vibes, and t-shirts with buff horses on. Our interns have set up donut merch stands all over Mexico. We're gonna make some deliveries. Make sure to park at the stand. We need time to drop everything off. Like a horse out of heck! Can we do it fast? Yes. Yes, we can. Apex, baby! Yeah, that would make a good shirt. Maybe a hat. Lightning, lightning, lightning! 
Final parking spot. Go! Who put this birch stand way out here? It must be Nolan's fault. Whew. Now all the donut fans at Horizon can get their sweet threads and recognize each other and hug and stuff. We did a good thing today. All right, high Z should have cooled down by now. You have arrived at your destination. That was a pretty great day. How about we finish it off with a night drive? Zach, you take the Miata. All right, nice driving by the way. Thanks for getting all that set up. That means you and I are in high Z, buddy. We're driving through the spooky woods at the base of the Grand Volcano. Uh, why? Who cares? This Miata rules. Uh, hey, Zach, it's uh, getting pretty dark out, isn't it? Uh, sure. Yeah, I guess it is. I think uh, maybe for safety, you know, you might want to turn on your... Oh no, here it comes. Pop, 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 and down headlights! Pop, 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 What was that noise? That was your brain being turned to mush by that song. Uh, seriously, Zach, I think we got a problem. Guys, it looks like the RPM's dropping. Uh, not good. Could be the mass airflow sensor, or maybe you've got an ignition issue. Or a fuel pump's on the fritz. So, hi z is broken down. It might be a mass airflow sensor, but I'll have to wait until first light to see. Which means our big broken baby is spending the night in the woods. <laughs> Welcome to high-low, baby! Shoulda brought the Tacoma.
There aren't Mexican bears in these woods, are there? You have arrived at your destination. Hey, James. So, high car broke down, huh? No. <laughs> You're right. We're just uh, testing the capabilities as an RV. Yeah, high car definitely broke down. Zach has an engine teardown under control, but it might take a while. What are we going to do? How about we take some cars and some cameras and get up to speed on the Nissan Z? So this is everything you need to know to get up to speed on the Nissan C while we drive on. No way, no way, no way. In October of 1969, the 240Z arrived in America, known in Japan as the Fair Lady C. The American version had a 2.4 liter inline six, giving it a robust 151 hertz pers. It could go from zero to 60 in just under eight seconds and cost around 3,600 bucks. I would love to buy a 240Z for 3,600 bucks. Jumping to more current times, in 2001, an announcement was made. The return of the Z to America. Nissan debuted a bright orange Z concept car, the Nissan 350Z. It was released to wide acclaim the very next year. While the 350Z was good, Nissan knew they could do better. Debuting in 2008, the Nissan 370Z was almost a complete redesign from the 350. The engine swapped out to the huge 3.7 liter V6. It was also still affordable and looked amazing. Lucky for us and all the Z-Series fans, Nissan didn't stop there. In 2023, the new Nissan Z arrived, the newest in their line of modern sports cars, this time with 400 hearse purrs. The new Z uses the same platform as the 370Z. Now it's got a three liter twin turbocharged V6 engine. Now I kind of wish I'd gotten the Roadster. <laughs> Z432 baby, can't beat a classic. My Z is the mightiest Z. This is great, but I still miss Heiko. Congratulations, you are now officially up to speed on the Nissan Z. Is the car fixed yet? This is an interesting new upgrade for high car. Yeah, we installed a full flatbed truck kit under it. It came out pretty well. Well, our car still works, so let's drive that. Hard right, then floor it. Nolan, high car on a flatbed can still beat low car any day of the week. Are you serious? Dude, come on. Uh, hey, so, um, I said a stupid thing to my buddy Nolan, and now you need to make me look less stupid. Um, can you do that?
I've got it. It was the crank angle sensor. That's a pretty easy replacement once we get back to the festival. for life, baby! You helped a lot, too. Thanks, pal. This is it. We did it. We are here. The final showdown of this very special, very exciting Horizon slash donut edition of High Low. We bought three nearly identical Nissan 350Zs. One got cheap parts, one got expensive parts, and for the first time ever, one got a mix of the two. I'll be in low car. I'll be in high car. And I'll be in mid-car with our special guest driver. Um, hi. It's time to find out, once and for all, does more expensive mean more better? Or is more in between -er, more gooder, and smarter? -er? Okay, that wasn't great, but it's a new format, so we can work on it. Let's go! Show them what Midcar can do! I see all day, baby! Woo! Whether it wins or not, low Z rules. You guys, it's been great working with you, but I'm running away to join Horizon. Be safe, have fun, I love you, but you're still gonna lose. More friends definitely means more better. Cause our pain! Aha! Uh -huh. Is the most important part. A detour! Take it off road! Let it eat! You did it! I can't believe you did it, dude! I am so proud of you! This changes everything. You're gonna have to move to LA. We need to get you some t-shirts and like a hat. Do you know how to read a teleprompter? <laughs> I've got a better idea. How about you all join us here for a while? Oh, can we, James? Can we, can we, please, please, please? I can't say no to that face. All right, maybe for a little while. So we're coming to the end of my YouTube video right now, so give a thumbs up button if you like the video so much. Click on that bell button to subscribe for more content and if you saw the recent video hey James, interesting you know the coming, share the right? comment right the below the description the so you can share some thoughts and feelings with everybody in the community and make them feel welcome mind. so I make a happy Corona 95 you'll have a great day and peace out